Code Cutest has arrived. And I've put it up against the, um, the Code Mojo. Now, the first sort of listening tests that I've been doing is that the Code Cutest running off a battery sounds very similar to this running off a battery. But when you add a power supply to this little fella here, it gives him a bit more fullness to the sound. Whether you prefer that or not is another matter. It's very close to this. I wouldn't say that. You no, know, I could live with that. It's just you, you would never know, need to ever listen to a cutest once you've had this modified. Just listen to it and enjoy it. They do very similar things. This one's a little bit more forward sounding, I would say. This one's a bit laid, more laid back. You can always turn your volume up. <laughs> Get a sub, get a bit more bass. But um, first impressions is that this is very good, but I need to get build a power supply for that. I've got one here. It's the size of a, um, the one you'd use for a, an amp and a power amplifier. But I like a big toroidal transformer. And there's, I've got it going down to 7 point, oh, 7 7.99 volts. I'd like to get it at 8, but once you know it's blue, then you know you're, you've got the right voltage. People say you need a 7.4 battery, that's true, but it gives off 8 volts, believe it or not. So it's 8 volts this thing runs on. And I prefer to give it a lot of oomph because when you're using the amplifier and saying you've got a big pop transformer, like that it gives it a lot of current. This thing's running a bit hot at the minute. So I've got it, that takes up to 5 amps of power supply. There we go. See you when I get my glasses.